the research shows now is that coffee in the day cuts the output of those hormones in half for five hours. Alcohol inhibits the output by up to 40%. So the stimulants interfere with the output of the hormones at night. Our brain is made up of nerve cells. The pineal gland also has cells that function in there that require oxygen. And we get more oxygen if we inhale and exhale always through the nose. The very part of the body where God breathed the breath of life into man. Nutrition, nourishing food. We've been looking at the food, the fruits, the vegetables, the nuts, the seeds, the whole grains and also the legumes. They provide all the nutrition necessary to make those hormones. Moderation, don't overdo it. When people eat their largest meal at night, it inhibits the output of those hormones at night because so much energy is required to digestion. See, when we go to sleep at night, our stomach wants to sleep too. That's why we should be eating most of our food at breakfast and lunch, our two main meals.